Grace Frame Bight is a really amazing ocean ecosystem that stretches all the way from Western Australia in the west to Tasmania in the east. It's the most amazing coastline. Well, I reckon there's more diversity along this coastline than the Great Barrier Reef. Mm. I've had lots of close encounters with wildlife while in surf. Lots of dolphins often come through and are really playful. The ocean is our backyard. I've been a lobster fisherman since I was 14 years old. It's all I'll ever do, it's all I've ever done. It's so special. We have ospreys, we have sea eagles, we have the whales come through there. The majority of ocean life found in the bite, 85%, is found nowhere else on the planet. You just can't see those animals in any other ocean of the world. That's what makes it so unique. The risk to the Great Australian Bight is that oil companies, as early as next summer, could have their drilling rigs just a few hundred kilometres off this pristine coastline, putting those hundreds of kilometres of cliffs and beaches and towns and ocean life at risk of a catastrophic oil spill. You go up to watch the whales, that's a beautiful time up there. And you're looking at the whales swimming below the cliffs and you think if an oil slick's coming, they've got nowhere to go. There'll be oil behind them and cliff in front, they'll just be dead. There is no precedent for drilling in that depth of water in potentially catastrophic uh, wave heights. Winning this campaign and protecting the coastline would feel amazing, kind of at a tipping point where you have to choose if you're on the sidelines or if you're going to do something to protect your home. The future's not mine always belongs to the next generation. So if, if we win this fight, we've actually won for the next generation. People power will win this campaign. It's the only thing we have, and I think it's getting stronger and stronger. People around Australia don't know what's at stake in the Great Australian Bight. It's not as famous as the Great Barrier Reef, even though it's home to more unique species than just about anywhere in the world. We need to share the stories of the people who are in that community who are fighting to protect the Great Australian Bight. We need people all around Australia who love the oceans and who care for our climate to let the world know this is a place they truly care about. If we do all that, the politicians will be forced to make the right decision and protect the Great Australian Bight for good. This is my country and I love it very deeply. I will fight for it.